Hi, boys and girls. It's Miss Rothstein here. For today's book, we are going to read the story Max Plants a Seed, a book about the life cycle of a sunflower. So this introduces readers to Max's day of planting a seed. It discusses the concept of a sunflower's life cycle through Max's planting experience. So this week we are discussing different kinds of plants and how they grow and what they need to grow. So I thought this was a great read aloud that is a nonfiction book about sunflower seeds. Today, Max plants a sunflower seed. How will it grow? Max plants the seed where it will get a lot of sunlight. He waters it. The seed soaks up water. Roots start to grow out of the seed. Then a stem grows out of the seed. This all happens underneath the soil. The stem comes out of the soil 11 days after Max plants it. The stem is tiny. The stem grows taller. It starts to grow leaves. A flower grows on the top. The flower makes hundreds of new seeds. Max collects the seeds. He will plant seeds again next year. What seeds would you like to plant? Have you already planted seeds? So in this book, we heard three new key words. We heard roots, which are a part of a plant that grows into the soil, and roots soak up water and feed the plant. We learned the word seed. A seed is something made by a plant. A seed could grow into a new plant. And the last new word that we heard was stem. A stem is the main part of a plant, and, it leaves, and its leaves grow on a stem. So we could take this book and extend the learning further into different activities. So think about these three questions and discuss them with your families. Number one, can you think of other plants that make seeds? And do all seeds look the same? Number two, have you ever planted a flower? What kind was it and how big did it grow? And number three, why do you think seeds need water and sunlight to grow? So those are all open-ended questions. Discuss it with your family and try to answer those questions to the best you can. We will also have some time to discuss it in our Zoom meeting on Thursday. Thanks for joining.